I would like to ask your permission to use this video for educational purpose and on the internet. Yes. Now, tell me about your symptoms before the surgery. Oh, I had a lot of pain, um, probably from mid-back down to lower spine. Um, and now I don't have any pain. Yeah, so the pain, how bad was it before the surgery? How bad was 1 to oh, 10 the pain before the surgery? I think at times it was a 10. It was a 10. Mm -hmm. Now, your surgery was about uh, actually two and a half years ago. Mm -hmm. It was in February of 2021. Correct. Now, after the surgery, when did you notice pain is getting better? Oh, How long did it take it to get better? I would say it was pretty good. After the post-surgical pain was done, I don't know that I had any real back pain. And you and the reason we are getting this testimonial, I have a lots of patients that have your situation. They have really bad pain, and then we do a minimal invasive surgery, and then they get better. But the reason I'm getting this testimonial is because I'm look, going to look back around here. Everything is, this was a huge surgery, and everything is growing except the bottom level. The bottom screws are a lot, uh, they are loosening. And the bottom level, even after two and a half years, still not growing. So quite honestly in the picture there is a problem but we decided we have seen it for the last year or so we are following it up but we decided not to do surgery another surgery Correct. do you remember why uh because i don't have any pain yes because you don't have any pain and don't see any reason to go and start try to you know do another surgery because i fix patient symptoms not pictures and and if, uh, this is actually a, uh, sometimes, you know, especially when I was young, I was thinking the picture need to look good. But now I am I'm more wise. I know that actually I should fix your symptoms, not the pictures. But tell me about your daily activity. Is there mostly you're happy where you are and with the pain? You said you have no pain. What about daily activity? Is that OK? Pretty good. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I, I still live in my own home do um, most of my own housework. Okay. What about walking? Yeah, I see you are a, you have a walker. Yeah. Can you do most of the stuff you can do with a walker? I don't walk without the walker at this point. Mm -hmm. I would like to. Yeah. But I just I'm not comfortable yet. Yeah. Walking yeah. without the walker. But I also have knee issues in it yeah. in addition to Yeah, in addition to that. No, no. For all practical purpose, you know, my goal is make you your symptoms uh, be better. And at this point, we are just going to watch this. Comparing this picture to every six months, we get a picture. Obviously, if something is not right, you come back. Um, but, you know, it seems that the bones start to grow. It's just very slow in that level. And we are just going to watch it. We are going to, if you have any symptom, we will fix it. But we are not going to fix just the pictures. Is that Thank okay you. with you? Thank you. Yes. <laughs> yeah, we don't, there's no reason to take additional risk of another surgery no, as long as you don't age. have any symptoms. <laughs> yes, that's a very important factor. When we get older, obviously, if surgery uh, has more risk, we are not going to take any unnecessary risk. No. Well, thank, thank you very you. much. <laughs>